Hey guys, it's Dr. Sam Robbins. Now today I'm going to quickly talk about porn, masturbation, orgasms, and testosterone levels. Now to get started, statistics show that every year there is an increase in porn consumption and the watching of porn by both men and women. Now the newest statistics also show that people, especially men, are masturbating more than ever and sadly, having the least amount of intercourse. There's a lot of sexless guys out there. Now, to make matters worse, every year, the statistics show that men's testosterone levels just keep dropping, while other antagonistic hormones, basically those that lower testosterone, just keep increasing, such as estrogen and cortisol, like stress hormones, DHT, the hair loss hormone, prolactin, and others. Basically, men are becoming more feminine, both physically and emotionally. And trust me, women don't like this. It's a big turnoff. So getting back to today's topic, does watching porn decrease testosterone levels? Well, the answer is no, it doesn't. In fact, watching porn and being aroused actually increases testosterone levels by as much as 35%, as long as you don't orgasm and ejaculate. So the next question is, does having an orgasm and ejaculating lower testosterone levels? Yes but it's just a little bit, but it's temporary. However, there is an increase in other hormones such as prolactin and oxytocin and serotonin levels while there's a drop in dopamine levels. Now, all of this decreases your sexual desire and ability to get an erection. Again, this is obviously all temporary, but for some guys, especially older guys over the age of 35 and 40, these negatives, right, they can can last a few days rather than a few hours when you're younger, especially when your testosterone levels aren't optimal to begin with. However, something does happen to testosterone, but it's at the receptor level. Basically, the receptors become less sensitive to testosterone. So even though testosterone levels may not drop much or change much, because they become less sensitive and receptive, you know, at the receptors, the same amount of testosterone doesn't work as well. But remember, this is all temporary but it does vary person to person. Remember, the older you are, the worse the problem, and the lower your testosterone levels are to begin with, the bigger and longer the problem. However, if you're watching porn, masturbating, and orgasming multiple times a day, like every day, then yes, it can negatively affect your hormones and cause a decrease in testosterone levels, sexual performance, your ability to get erections, and yes, even decrease penis size over time. Now, one last thing abstinence and thus, you know, not having any orgasms, not masturbating, none of that stuff does not increase testosterone levels either. So, you know, both ways it ends up being the same. So what are your options if you want to maximize your testosterone levels and still watch porn and, you know, quote unquote, do all the other stuff? Well, you can reduce the masturbation or more specifically the orgasms from time to time. All right. You can also take herbs and supplements and, and vitamins like vitamin D and so forth, all these things that are found in alpha viral, which help optimize all your hormones that I mentioned today and thus produce healthy testosterone levels, balanced you know, hormones and female hormones, and improve sexual performance. And I've got a lot more information about this below this video in the description area for the best ways for you to optimize your hormones and testosterone levels. Lastly, and more importantly, you gotta improve your lifestyle, right? There's no way around it. If you're gonna eat junk, if you're never going to exercise or go outside or take any supplements that your body needs, if you're going to be isolated and not interact with others, then for sure your positive, youthful, quote-unquote alpha male hormones are going to drop, all right? You're going to become more feminine. Listen, exercise is very important for your hormones. Getting sunlight and vitamin D is needed. Good quality, deep sleep is vital. And let's not, let's not forget real Physical contact with another human being should never be replaced by porn. So I hope this was helpful. Let me know your questions below. Let me know if something you want more about. I will do the videos for you in the future. Subscribe if you already aren't. Click the notification icon so you get similar content. As always, thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. And I wish you a very happy and healthy day.